Hi guys, Ms. Perkins here. Today we're going to talk about Module 2, Lesson 11. This lesson we're talking about being able to solve addition sentences. So looking at this, we're going to read our word problem, and then we're going to make the addition sense, and we're going to solve it. So it says, Larry glued on five pieces of brown yarn for his puppet's hair. He glued eight pieces of red yarn for more hair. How many pieces of yarn did Louis use? I'm going to read it again because we, we, we read it three times. So Louis glued on five pieces of brown yarn for his puppet's hair. He then glued on eight pieces of red yarn for more hair. How many pieces of yarn did Louis use? So I'm going to read it one more time. Make sure you're making that math moving in your head. Louis glued on five pieces of brown yarn for his puppet's hair. He then glued on eight pieces of red yarn for more hair. How many pieces of yarn did Louis use? So now we're going to do cubes. We know that first we're going to circle those important numbers, which is five and eight. Underline on the question, which we know we find the question mark, and we go back until we see the period. Now we're going to box in important words. So we're going to box in pieces and then we're also going to box in brown yarn then for the eight we're going to box in pieces and we're going to box in red yarn all right so now we're going to draw our picture so we know that gluey that louie glued on five pieces of brown yarn and then he did eight pieces of red yarn so we're going to draw the bigger number first Okay, so let's draw our bigger number, which we know is 8. So let's draw 8, the 5 group way, 7, 8. So that is the red yarn that he used for his puppet's hair. Now we're going to draw 5. Now we know that we're going to use X's for this, but we can clearly see what's going on. So it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Now what we're going to do is that we're going to box in 10. So we can clearly see what's 10 and what's left. Okay, so now we'll be able to count on by counting this as 10. So 10, 11, 12, 13. So we know that there was 5 plus 8 equals. Well, let's count on. We can say 10, 11, 12, 13. So we know that 5 plus 8 equals 13, just like how we box it in. And we knew that 10 plus 3 equals 13, which helped us figure out what 5 plus 8 was. So 5 plus 8 equals 13. So how many pieces of yarn did Louis use? He used 13 pieces of yarn. Alrighty, guys, that's it for this video.